so guys let's do some quick warm up i don't want to waste your time let's start with the workout so our first exercise is for beginners and this is single leg step up so you have to do 10 repetitions each leg and there are three sets of it see that my right leg is stable and i am just moving my left leg and make sure to have a mind muscle connection while doing your exercises because this is very important for every athlete and you have to kick while doing the up movement so from the beginner ones to the intermediate i have increased the six repetition now there are 16 repetitions and there are three sets of it so for the advanced player i have just added the dumbbells in the previous exercises and the repetitions are same as intermediate 16 so make sure to feel the contraction while doing the upward movement and try to be in a stable position while doing this so our third exercise is box jump this exercise is for beginners and there are 10 repetition and there are three sets of it when you are jumping and when you are landing make sure to have a stability in your ankles and keep the pace slow we don't want in any injury in your ankles if you have different types of boxes you can use that also but i have this stepper so i am doing on that try to do this exercise in a controlled way so now for intermediates so the exercise is almost same i have just increased the height of it if anyone finds it difficult to jump on a bigger box he or she can decrease the height of the box also i have decreased the repetition from 16 to 10 so there are 10 repetition and there are three sets of it for the advanced player i have put 15 repetition and there are three sets of it and make sure to have a good form while performing this exercise while i'm landing on the platform i am in the squats position so make sure to do it as similar to me keep your core tight and make your upper body stable don't move that too much if you don't do this in the correct form you might face injuries because your heels are connected to the hamstring and your hamstring is connected to the back next so exercise then, is single leg box jump this exercise is for beginners and it's a variation of the previous one for the beginners i have set the repetition to the 10 and there are three sets of it after completing one set of this exercise you have to take 30 second break what you have to do in this 30 second then you Just have to maximize your strength and speed so let's move towards the intermediate players this exercise is single leg box jump and there are 10 repetition each and There are 10 repetition each of 3 sets. This exercise is very difficult for intermediate players so I suggest them to decrease the height of the box that they are using or a question can be raised here that we don't do jump smash with single leg. So why you are doing these exercises? So my answer is to those that my answer is to those that My answer is that this help you when the shuttle is in your overhead. While you are jumping try to take a pause of 1 second because that will improve your ankle stability while you are doing this exercise. Make sure to have a soft landing while you are jumping and try to stay balanced while you are jumping because if you don't do that this will directly impact your knees. So I have added a slow motion clip You can see how to do the single leg jump exercise. If you guys are not be able to do this exercise, I would suggest you to start with the beginner phase first because this is very advanced one. So our next exercise is for beginner. This is high on squat jumping. Because for the intermediate and advanced players I have added the jump squats. I would suggest you to go phase wise. First you have to do the beginners and then intermediate and then advanced. So let's move towards intermediate. This is the squat jump exercise. You have to do 10 repetition and there are three sets of it. I have decreased the repetition because of the intensity of this exercise is very high.
For the advanced player, I have just increased the repetition. The exercise is same. Make sure to have a good form while you are doing this exercise, and make sure that your knees don't bend inside. I've added a slow motion so you can see. Make sure to land on the forefoot and not on the heels because if you try to do so, you will end up in hurting your heels. Try to maximize your jump while having a good form. If you are not be able to do with the good form, I would suggest you to first correct your form and then try to jump higher. So this exercise is for beginners. This is single leg front lunges. You have to do 10 repetitions from each leg and there are 3 sets of it. Try to go slow for the first few reps and then try to increase your speed while doing this exercise. So the next exercise is for intermediate, this is Bulgarian split squat. This is a very advanced exercise so I have added in the intermediate. There are 15 repetitions from each leg and there are 3 sets of it. Try to make a balance and try to jump from your right leg because this will, because this will increase the intensity of this exercise and increase your jumps ultimate. Try to create a 90 degree angle between your knees and make sure to try this exercise on a soft platform. For the advanced player, I have just added the dumbbell to increase the intensity level. Try to feel the connection between your muscles and mind because this will help you to increase your, increase your focus and to recover better. There are 15 repetitions from each leg and there are 3 sets of it. Try to complete these exercises within 1 hour. So guys let's do some quick cool down. I have mentioned many exercises you can pause and see all of them. If you like this video please make sure to subscribe my channel because I will upload further more videos like that. Target is 500 likes.